Hello there everyone, Ash and Flash here, and welcome on back to the Custom Minifigure Mondays series, and I'm so excited to be back. One week I took off, and then the other week I was like, it was 11.50 on the Monday, and I was like, oh, I gotta get ready for tomorrow's Minifigure Monday. And then I, I realized that it was actually Monday, because I have no sense of time right now. But anyways, we're back, we're here. This is my custom Lego the Batman Who Laughs, and I'm really happy with how this turned out. I think this is one of the best figures that we've ever done uh, for the series, so I'm really, really excited to show you the different parts and talk about that, but uh, this was actually chosen by you guys. I put a poll up on my community tab, and 50% of you guys who voted in the poll actually said that you wanted this, so here it is, and honestly, like I said before, I think that this is one of the best detailed and some of the part usage I'm just really excited about here. So without further ado, let's go ahead and let's break it down. First of all, let's start with that helmet. How did I even do that? Well, that's actually a tire piece around a cowl. And I'll take it off towards the end of the video. But I don't know who originally came up with that. But it's just, it's such a genius idea. Good on them. Who Whoever thought to put a tie around the regular Batman cowl. I think it works really, really well. And underneath that, you've got a Joker face from the Lego Batman movie. And really, you could do any of them, but just the ones with the wide grin work the best, I think. I tried a couple of other Joker faces, and just the the width of the smile doesn't... Uh, it, it's not as long as the ones from the Lego Batman movie, so I think this just works so much better. And the collar there is actually the... Black Panther's collar from the bike set from January of 2020 Avengers. And then the other piece underneath that is the Jafarmer. And that's the armor piece, whatever, from Jafar from the Lego Disney series. And of course, it's from Ninjago and different things. The cape is actually one of the capes from the Mandalorian battle pack and it's the one of course that's black and then the torso and the legs are probably the most difficult to get your hands on but probably what really sells this figure for me and it's actually one of the knights of ren and this is from kylo ren shuttle from the rise of skywalker so that's where that's from and of course i had to sub out the hands because they are black in the set for white hands and you can see them there they're actually holding some chains and it's meant to represent like the chains that he has around some of the dark robins and different things again i would love to do a dark robin but just the, the pieces don't exist i've also seen some pretty incredible customs for the other versions of batman so i'd love to do some other uh, costumes and different things from the dark knights metal i think that would look so so cool i've seen some really great customs and purists that I'd love to feature on the series. Anyways, everyone, that is my custom The Batman Who Laughs. And before I wrap things up, let me show you how it works with the helmet there. So I'll just take it off. You just have to slide it right over the eyes there. So you take the tire. It might ruin the tire. I'm not sure. I haven't had it on for too long. Um, and then you just slide it down on top of the eyes. And you don't want to go too far down, but just enough. And then I also didn't want to damage the uh, cowl piece there. You got to be careful when you're putting that on. But yeah, that is it for this custom minifigure Monday. Let me know down below in the comment section what you think of it. I've already got the next few plotted out thanks to you guys from the community tab. So if you want to go maybe move things around, uh, you can go vote there. But anyways, everyone, I hope that you did enjoy the video. And I hope that you all have a great day. I'll see you all in the next one.